After our first clip showing how to put a bicycle onto a 2D express rack, we had a few requests to show how to put the second bike on, which is what we're going to do today. The two most important things to know about putting the second bike onto the 2D rack is first of all that the bike must be facing the other way, and the second thing is that the 2D clips can actually twist, which we're going to show you how useful that can be now. To put the bike onto the rack, Obviously the first time you ever do it, you will have to work it out as each bike is slightly different. But once you've done it the first time, you'll know exactly how to put it on the second time. And you can go very, very quickly into the correct position. That's what we're going to do here now. This particular bike starts off quite well by using the down tube. So we're going to twist the first clip on. Line up the down tube. And drop the handlebars. I'm making this one look way more complicated than it should be. So there you have the down tube on. For the back part, it's quite useful to leave the cup upright until you're in position, so the sides of the cup don't get in the way. Once the bike is in position, it's a simple matter of rolling the clamp down and clamping it on. You can cut now already. <laughs> comes with a strap to hold your wheels together. What that does is prevent your wheel from spinning, which on a long trip can actually wear the bearings in your hub and on your free wheel body. And it also helps with preventing the bike from swinging together. Of course the bike will still have a bit of movement and can still swing together. So in that case you can use alternatively some extra ropes or tires to try and hold the bikes more firmly. And of course the staple of using foam or old tiles or cloths at any point where the bikes may make contact together to help prevent friction and rubbing or impact. In this case this one is actually made for a fork and you can clip it straight over the fork and as you can see it protects against any impact.